Welcome my friend, today I'm gonna show you how to bypass this error with the DUC dynamic update client of NoIB because when you open the VBN and connect with the VBN it cannot take the IB from it as you can see in a few minutes okay. so when you go to tab windows adapter version 9 as you can see he, it's include an IB you have an IB but when you just refresh it the no IB client does not respond for that and this is why I create this script with new JS that will help you to do that uh, I use just this three libraries uh, the operation system and HTTPS and string um, so I create let for network interface and I have all the interface with for loop and put it in that array and you know I print the interfaces and go to interface of Ethernet 2 the index 1 and the address and that's where my IB will be. I don't think it will show up right over here or not. Oh, yeah, that is my IB address. Yeah, this is the one. So I go to the interface Ethernet 2 and get the IB address from it. By the way, you can find this on my GitHub repo. And after I have the interface IB, I go to HTTPS of the, you know, the no IB update host. It's from the, the support website. I will put the link down below either. And I put the interface with the IB, the username and password, and the host name. Uh, and that's me the host name okay and after that I just return the data that return from that get request to know if that work or not and I put it all that in interval inside try, try method uh, you know to not cause any damage or crash when it's just Recon and re get over and over and over in one minute 16 seconds and yeah that's it and now let's taste it Now put all my my information in this URL and let's go ahead and do node app.js Damn, I forgot to make this like one second. Okay, now let's test it. Okay, so it's returned good and that's a great because take a look of the IB it's will change soon as you can see it is the same IB that I have right over here and that's done thank you for watching